What's up guys, it's me, The Real T. So as you can see, we are back in my runway. It's been a while since I've done one of these videos, but I wanted to throw together some outfits for you for these cold, cold winter months. So anyway, this haul is going to be Fashion Nova. You already know all these sales they got going on. Now is the perfect time to pick up all of these pieces. But anyway, without further ado, let's get into the trying on part. So I've got this big huge bag right here and I've also got this that I'm going to be showing off as well to you. It's a like faux fur type of cropped jacket, it goes with everything. I mainly bought it to wear with my New Year's outfit but honestly it can be worn with many outfits because it's white, it's versatile, fits perfectly with the cold months and it's very warm surprisingly and it's pretty good quality as well. So I'm going to be including this. but. We also have this big bag to get through. So let's go. Okay, so first things first, we have this super, super cute, very classy orange romper. I bought this to wear for Thanksgiving dinner and it's definitely giving. Luckily on your end, you cannot tell how uncomfortable this is. It's not like horrible material or anything, it's just very, um, I, I feel like they made it snatched for a reason. They want you to look snatched, so they made it a little tight. Also, excuse the pup in the background. She's in attention for just like my cat. But anyway, so yeah, this is obviously a romper. It's kind of got this like blazer type of feel. There is no pocket, so that kind of sucks. But oh my goodness, this detailing, bruh, it's giving. Look at the sides, cut outside, some chains. Also the same on this side, and then we've got some nice little buttons. And it just, it looks so nice with this collar. It's got some good coverage, it's not too short. Perfect. Also, just so you guys know, there is a zipper in the middle, and then obviously you have these buttons. This button is like a real button, and then when you open this, there's a clear button that you're gonna secure as well to further give you that snatched look. But yeah, I really love this, this is super cute. I got it in. A size large in orange obviously I would suggest sizing up typically I can fit mediums but when it comes to stuff like this or like romper material in general I tend to size up to a large because you know you just never know with this material and luckily it fits but a medium I would definitely not be able to get into and even this was a little bit hard to put on as well because let's not lie like I got a long torso so I think if my torso was just a little shorter, then it wouldn't be so tight around the shoulders. The shoulders are also padded, so I'm sure that doesn't help. But it is very cute. Um, I don't think I'm gonna be getting any more colors of this, but I mean, it is a cute, like, one-time piece sort of thing, and it's definitely gonna be worn for Thanksgiving dinner. But anyway, let's get into this runway walk. Let's try our next one. Okay, here is our second look. You'll be able to see it better when I do the runway walk. Basically, it's your standard sweater material dress. It goes all the way down to about mid calf. I think that's how it's meant to fit anyways. So good on the length. The size I got in this was a medium. So the stretch and the comfortability of it is definitely there. So this is definitely something you want in your closet. Long sleeves for those cold winter days. And you can also do the cold shoulder type of look as well to emphasize your collarbone. Very feminine look. I love showing off my collarbone as weird as that sounds. And there's my cat. We really got an audience today, you guys. But anyway, yeah, I do love this dress. It's very cute. If you wanted to accessorize, you could wear a simple waist belt, 
Um, basically, any type of purse would go with this. Black is such a universal color that anything would work with this. And it's just so cute. Um, with the cold shoulder looks, I tend to wear my hair down just for a little bit of coverage, I guess. But technically, I guess it'd be fine if you wore your hair up with this as well. But this is so cute. Like I said, it's a medium, so stick with your standard size. This dress is very stretchy, thankfully. Here's the back. Very cute. Very warm as well. I'm actually getting a little hot even though I have the fan going. But yeah, this is super cute. I love it. 10 out of 10 for me. And by the way, this comes in a wide array of colors. So if you don't like black or if you want something a little bit more bold and out there, then they have tons of colors. So feel free to buy this dress. Don't let the black keep you away because it's definitely something that is a staple and that you want in your closet for all seasons. But anyway, let's get into this runway walk. one piece look obviously this is like a like a jumpsuit or romper or whatever it's all one piece so you don't have to worry about finding the matching piece which I love because I always lose all my matching pieces to all my pajama sets so I mainly bought this to wear because it's like Christmas themed you guys know I don't really wear red too much but this is like your classic Christmas pattern like the red and black plaid so when I saw this, I was like, this is really cute. And if you look at the neckline, still got a little peekaboo there. They do have buttons, but they are just for show. They don't actually button into anything. So don't get this if you're like, you know, trying to go to your family's holiday party or whatever. This is more of a friend's Christmas or like a you and your boyfriend Christmas. It's not really something I would feel comfortable wearing around like in-laws or anything like that. But it is really cute, it's very flattering. It does stretch quite a bit. This is a size medium. As you can see, we still got quite a bit of stretchy room, which is really impressive for Fashion Nova because I'm telling you, when I buy pieces like this that are all one piece attached, it's usually not good. So it looks like they did pretty good with this material. It's also very warm, very soft, very comfortable. Definitely 10 out of 10 for this one as well. You guys will probably be seeing this when I decorate my house for Christmas because you know, I just want to get into the spirit and this is perfect for that. All the Christmas lights and everything like that will look perfect with this type of ensemble. But anyway, so you guys can see the full effect, we are going to do our runway walk right now. Let's go. Very cute, very festive. Let's get into the next outfit. Okay, so here is the first of the paired outfits. I cannot zip this in the back. As you can see, it's very short. This skirt I got in a medium. I probably read the reviews online and that was the size that I thought would work for me, but it does not. As you guys know, I am a curvy woman and I do not suggest sizing down or anything like that. Get your normal size, maybe even size up. I don't know if a large would have worked for me. Because I was able to get into this, but zipping it is a different story. And just overall movement in it is also a different story. You can't, probably can't tell on your end, but it's not good for me. But anyways, so we also have this really cute white sweater. It's got some like polka dot detailing on the arms and turtleneck. I love my turtlenecks, especially in the cold months. But unfortunately it is see-through, which is why I have my hair where it's placed because you know, YouTube and everything. Don't wanna get in trouble. But I don't really know about this sweater as well. It is super cute, it looks really good. But the turtleneck is kinda of tight. And I got a medium in this. So I wonder if I would've went with a large, maybe it would've fit better. I mean, it's loose around the waist and everything. And it's nice around the sleeves, but the turtleneck is like choking me, <laughs> for lack of a better word. But yeah, anyways, I am disappointed about this skirt. I don't believe I can return it because I don't know if it's a final sale or what, but I'm pretty sure I'm not able to return it. I got it really cheap anyway. So if you want this skirt and you follow me on Instagram, DM me and I will ship this skirt to you for free, free of charge. All I have to do is make sure you follow me on YouTube and follow me on Instagram and I got you. You have this skirt for the free. 
but yeah so I don't think I'm gonna be able to do a runway walk in this because like I said I cannot dip this like at all I keep trying it's not working there's no way here it's like sucking in everything that I got and then it's got this cute little slit in the front and I really disappointed I really love this like mint color and I really wanted to love this skirt but there's just no way I can make it work so DM me if you want it let's move on to the next outfit okay so here we are with some more bottoms these are like faux leather just long pants you know whatever I think these look really good these are a size medium when I was putting them on I was a little concerned about getting them up you just have to maneuver it the right way and then once you get them on they're actually quite comfortable for what they are, for what it's worth. And I could have changed the top. This is the same top from the previous outfit you saw, but we did get to do a runway walk with that outfit. So I'm gonna go ahead and put it on with this one. But yeah, these are really cute. I got them in a size medium. I think I could have gotten away with a size large as well. I think they still would have fit, but these are like enough for me to be able to move around in. So I'm probably not gonna return them. Probably just gonna keep them and I hope that I remember to not put these in the dryer because I don't want them to shrink. But they are very flattering, very cute. And you compare this with white, you compare it with nude, like other browns, whatever, very cute. Very versatile, works with everything basically. But yeah, let's do this runway walk so you guys can see the pants and the shirt in all of their glory. Very cute. Anyways, moving on to the next few items. So here is the second to last look. As you can see, we have another turtleneck sweater. This one is like a mauve color, size medium. And you see how like much looser this turtleneck is compared to the other one. I can actually breathe. And it's just overall really nice material. I did notice though when I was putting this on, my rings kept getting a, like caught in these little holes and stuff. So just be careful when you're putting this on. I also do not recommend putting this in the washing machine because you just, you never know. You don't want to risk that. And then this is how it's, how I had it planned in my head. Like a little tuck, you know, whatever. But it looks kind of weird. So maybe we are going to loosen it. Anyways, so this is actually the same type of skirt that that blue one was. Except this time, this is a size large, and the blue one was like crocodile print. So even though it's the same like type of skirt, same type of material, it just had that crocodile print. Pretty sure that one is non-refundable. This one might be, but I cannot remember. But again, this is a size large, and pretty sure that I also cannot get this one up either. I don't know if it's because the zipper is stuck or if it just will not work. But I mean, if you look from the side, it's definitely not too big. It just won't go up. I think the zipper might be stuck. So maybe this one is fine in a size large, but again, you have that open detailing on the leg, a little V cut just for a little exposure. This would look really cute with some heels, but I'd more than likely probably wear this with like some thigh high boots, just so my legs aren't so exposed, especially once again in these cold winter months. And it is very, very short in the back. Or maybe I'm just considered tall. Not really sure. I'm only 5'5", five five, so I'm not really sure what that's about. But again, size large in the skirt, size medium in the top. And this one, I will do a runway walk. Even though my zipper is not up all the way, you still can't really see anything. So let's do this runway walk and then move on to the next fit. Then we have is this long chocolate skirt. Um, I probably pair it with a different top than this, other than what we're wearing right now, but this is just for trying on purposes only. But yeah, as you can see, it goes up to the belly button. Very flattering, very cute, but the waistline is a little tight. I think they made it this way on purpose because it's it's literally called olive oil skirt. So I think it's meant to give you those curves and meant to stick to you like 
meant to keep you snatched, basically. So I probably would have gotten this in a large, but this is a medium. Plus, since it's long, you know, it's got like that pencil skirt type of feel. So I definitely think I should have went up to a large, but I think it still would work for my body type. It still looks good. I'm just not sure how it would look if I like sat down or whatever. It might be a little uncomfortable because like you could see not too tight around the waist, but not like comfortably fitting. It's definitely like slipping me in. So yeah, but it's still cute. Um, not my favorite again, but it is what it is, whatever. But yeah, you guys can let me know if you like this skirt or not down in the comments. Again, this was something that was really cheap, so I'm not even sure if they'll let me return it or not. Um, and maybe I won't return it. Maybe I'll learn to love it. But these kind of skirts are more my style because I don't have to worry about them being too short. Like, I can bend over if I drop something, you know. Like, don't have to worry about anything popping out of place. So that's good. That is something that I do appreciate about these longer skirts. And again, they work perfectly for the fall months when you're trying to stay a little bit cozier than normal, like in the summer. But yeah, let's do our runway walk and then we're gonna close out the video. It's low key given like, this whole fit is like teacher librarian vibes. But I kinda like it, I kinda like it, I do. All right, you guys, this lighting is not that good, so I'm gonna move my camera to another spot and then we're gonna close out this video. So give me one moment. So excuse the mess behind me, that's everything that we just tried on. Really quick before we end the video, I wanted to talk about this cropped jacket that I mentioned in the beginning of the video. Very cute, very stylish, very warm. Um, if you can't tell, the faux fur on this is flawless, it's amazing very good quality faux fur. I don't ever condone or support wearing real animal fur. I just, you know, can't get behind it. But this is something that you need in your closet for sure. Like, oh my God, it's so warm. It's so cute. The crop detailing still allows you to show a little bit of curves off, you know. And it just looks very expensive, even though I bought it at such a good price. It's very good material. As you can see, I can move around. And it's still thick, like this is something that you need in your closet and you don't really need to worry about getting cold even though you don't have a lot of coverage. It's just such good material, it doesn't even matter. But yeah, it's very short as you can see, it is around the bust area. If you wanna clasp it, they do have clasps for you to clasp yourself. But I prefer the open look, it just looks, I don't know, it just gives me the vibes that I'm going for. Very, very nice and it makes me feel expensive, even though I'm on a budget, but yeah, very cute. You definitely need this in your closet. They have it in this ivory color. They also have a nice black color, but I've already got a black jacket that is like, you know, the faux fur vibes. So I wanted to get this white one first, but I probably will go back and get the black one as well because this is just a staple. It's beautiful. And by the way, this is a size medium. I'm about a 34, 36 around the bust area, so keep that in mind. You want to be able to move your arms. My shoulders are pretty broad, so I didn't want to get a small because I figured it would be too small. I feel like a large would be too large. So I would say just take that into consideration if you order this. For me though, a medium is perfect, um, but I, I think a small definitely would have been too small. So keep that in mind. Um, Definitely read the reviews on this because you don't want to buy this and then have to return it. It did take up quite a bit of room in the package that I got it in. It comes in this bag, so my plan is to keep this bag and it zips. And I'm just gonna store it in this bag because I don't want it to get ruined in my closet and I also don't want it to shed on my other jackets in my closet. But yeah, let's move on. So excuse the background. Obviously we're like in between my kitchen and my dining room, but that's irrelevant, ignore it, whatever. It's getting later, so the lighting is not the best at this hour, but the goal was to record my video, which I did, it showed you guys all these outfits, showed you what to pair them with, what would work, and I think we did a pretty good job. This haul, I would give maybe a six out of 10. Really disappointed by those shorter skirts. They're like unbelievably short. Fashion Nova, I don't know what you're trying to push, but that's not the way to go. I'm gonna need a little bit more fabric for me because, that just was not what it was meant to be. 
So really quick, I just wanted to show off my autumnal nails because they came out really good. Shout out to my nail guy, James. If he ever sees this, I don't think he will. But anyway, let's get into these nails. I love them. They're so, so cute. And they even match my little sweater here. But yeah, how cute are they? They're so good. But yeah, these are my Thanksgiving nails, you guys. Very cute. Very stylish. Giving fall. She's an autumn queen. I'm gonna close out this video. Thank you guys so much for watching. Make sure you comment down below what your favorite piece was or what your favorite outfit was. Let me know what you want to see in future video ideas as well. If you want to see these outfits like in real life, out, whatever, you can always follow me on Instagram at Tata Buddha and I will place that here like always. And make sure you turn on your bell notifications so you can get notified every time I upload. Of course, all these items will be listed in the description down below if you want to pick them up for yourself. But anyway, that is the end of the video. Thank you guys so much for watching once again. Love and light.